Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and today I'm showing some under the seas party ideas. I made this jellyfish and this coral wreath for a friend for a birthday party then we decided to make that like a day before the party and because they will just have the movie scene as you can see we put a bunch of blankets and things on the floor for the kids and then we decided to make a little table just for the party for the pictures kind of so we made this probably like in two or three hours no more than that so you can find those paper lanterns everywhere i will leave in the box below um i will look around for you guys and leave in the box below where you can find it and then we're gonna just count three or three wires down from the bottom and then we're gonna cut that piece off. This cra uh, crab uh, streamer you can find anywhere for parties, even at the dollar store comes with you. And now I'm just gonna go around the hog glue and we're gonna place this all around very carefully because we don't want it to burn our fingers for a party if everything that i say all the time i have a lot of questions on my um pinterest on my instagram like this was a pinterest um picture then i have been getting a lot of emails asking how i made it so that's what i decided to do it right now because it's a fast video and i had it done i just didn't add it so i decided to put it right now for you guys but it's easy to make just a table and some background decorations for pictures without spending a lot of money i know that everybody's in the budget now it's christmas some kids have birthdays on december and november so it's hard to spend that much money and this one under the sea is a really easy one for you guys to make it without spending crazy money to do like on the budget because it's all paper you can cut little fishes in the paper you can make the reef with the pool noodles we can make jellyfish with those lanterns and it's just paper so you don't spend a lot of money so that's why i decided to get this old video and just update it and give for you guys these little ribbons come with the lantern so we're gonna th there's two little circle wires on the top of the lantern and that's where we're gonna just give a little knot on both of them so we have a, like a really good place to hang them because it's a paper you don't want to make it you know any cuts more than we're already cutting off um, and then it's gonna make easy for you to hang anywhere to, if you making inside the house it's easy to hang in the, in the ceiling if you're putting a party outside it's easy to hang in trees and hanging on those stands anywhere you're making it so just remember that this picture you guys are seeing we made a party very fast and you can do too you can get on the budget dollar store tablecloth and just cover everything blue and put it like this jellyfish around and fish like pictures and emo things like that so the same paper the crab paper i'm just not measuring it just getting long pieces probably like 14 16 inches each and i'm just gonna cut that and then we're gonna fold it in half because i thought that this was too wide to be the legs of the jellyfish so we're gonna cut it in half so you fold them and cut it in half and we're probably gonna make i don't know like six yeah six or seven um for each lantern like for each jellyfish as one of the things that's how many like little tentacles you want to put it on the jellyfish but um we're going to use the crafting paper and we're going to use another the, the streaming balloon holder you know little stream tube so we're going to see i think i put six in each one of them but you just fold it and cut it in half and now you put a little hot glue and you glue and the inside of it, your Go 
going all around. And then we're going to use this balloon holder kind of string that comes in the dollar store, comes in other colors. And I'm just going to cut pieces. Like this, I'm going to make one super long, one short, because I wanted to give that jellyfish kind of like a 3D effect. Because if, in, if you have like different length, it looks like she's flying around like it. You know, like the water is making it move. Or it's just my head, my crazy crafty head. But I think it looks cooler when you don't measure, at least for this one. And now I'm gluing it this inside again for the lantern between those other than we did here. So that's why I asked you to leave a finger or two between them. And now we're gonna place this one. And it's pretty much done. And you can hang it everywhere and it looks so cute. The, the kids are crazy about it. And I think that my um, Pinterest is going crazy every time I get messages asking how I did that. And it's not hard, guys. It's pretty much really cute. And I hope you guys really like it. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and press the little um, bell button so you guys gonna know when I'm uploading more videos because now for Christmas I wanna give you back all the love that I have received this year. So I wanna make as many videos as I can at the oh, end of November, beginning of December with Christmas with um, a normal, you know, tutorials coming up. So I hope you guys like it here. I'm just gonna show some other colors that I use because I I believe here below when I got it, I went to picking all different colors and I thought that looked very cute. So that's it and for today's video. Bye!